In the space of a few years, the South African Paramount Group have, this, have established themselves as one of the leaders, design, developers, and manufacturers of wheeled armoured fighting vehicles. And what is interesting, all of their production has been for export. The early vehicles were the Matador and Marauder, which were really mine-resistant, ambush-protected type vehicle. But they've now moved up market. If we look at this one, this is the Mabombi 6, which was launched a few years ago, and this is a wheeled infantry fighting vehicle. As you can see, six-wheel drive, and this particular example is fitted with a Jordanian snakehead cupola armed with a 50 cal machine gun. When it was first launched, it was shown with a remote control turret armed with a 30mm Russian 2A42 and a 7.62 machine gun, and, and of course, grenade launchers. This vehicle, first customer for this, is Jordan Armed Forces. They have placed an order for 50 vehicles, and the first of these were delivered to Jordan early this year. And there's a progressive transfer of production to Jordan to help the local economy. So this is Mabombi 6x6. If we move over to this one, this is the latest one. This is Mabombi 8x8. And as it implies, it's an 8x8 vehicle, so it has more volume, more payload, and can therefore undertake a wider range of roles. It was first shown in Kazakhstan this year, fit of the unique turret. This is the Russian 57 meter turret, which is remote controlled, and is laid onto the target from within inside the, the vehicle. This time, it's been shown with another turret. This is a remote controlled turret, and as you can see, it's armed with a 30 millimeter cannon. This is not a Western 30mm cannon, this is a Russian. This is a widely deployed Russian 2A42, which is also fitted to some of the Russian infantry fighting vehicles. They fitted this weapon, rather than perhaps a 30mm Mark 44, as ammunition is available worldwide much cheaper. You can see it's a dual feed cannon with the feeds on top, and to the left of that is a 7.62mm machine gun. Tip of gross vehicle weight is about 28 tonnes, and a payload is about 8 tonnes and the payload includes the crew, the weapon, the ammunition and many of the other items that a vehicle has to carry. This vehicle is only just being completed and will soon start its trials. But it just shows to show what a country like South Africa can do within the space of a few years to develop a whole family of 4x4, 6x6 and 8x8 vehicles. And what does that do to the end user? Well, it's commonality. Those vehicles have 80% of same parts, so that is lower procurement costs, lower operating costs, and also it makes it easier to train and operate. So it will be interesting to see how the Mobombi 8 progresses in future years. We'll probably see it with different turrets and different weapon systems. It can also be used as a command post, as an ambulance, but being an 8x8 vehicle, it's got exceptional cross-country mobility.